Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. Yeah, if you haven't noticed or if you've been on this channel for a while, you'll know that I have a new like intro now. That was good for me. I'm gonna give myself a little pat on the back because I <laughs> I made it and you can probably definitely tell that it is not professional, but you know your girl did her best and I and I really like it. So I hope you do too. I think it's a lot of fun. I'm definitely gonna try and keep it like that with all my new video or upcoming videos. But I guess like <laughs> That's the point of them. They're supposed to be there for like every beginning of your YouTube video. I don't know why I said that. But anyways, I want to welcome you to part three of this journey of this build that we have been on together. And if you haven't taken a look at all of the, uh, the other two parts, girl, you're in the wrong spot, but it's okay. It's okay. I got you. I will have everything linked down below for the last two parts and I will have it at the end of the video with all the screenshots because now we can have all the screenshots there because this is the final destination. The train has stopped and the school's coming together. It's definitely something that I've never done before. This is definitely something that I probably won't do again for another long time coming. And I had a lot of fun though, don't get me wrong. Also, if I don't think I explained this in the two other parts, but you see that there's sinks everywhere. I, I'm just like picturing those in my mind that they're like water fountains. Because at my school we had a lot of water fountains. So if you're like, why does she keep putting a bunch of like sinks everywhere? <laughs> They're, 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 they're the water thingies that you drink out of. I literally, it, it's not in my mind anymore. I forget what it looks like. Um, here we are going to be changing a lot of things though. Um, especially like I mentioned in my previous build, we are doing a renovation to the hallways because I didn't like the way that it looked like so bright and I kind of wanted to change the look. I went from like a, a white to like a green and then I just decided to go like all brown and I really like it I did change the wallpaper as well so there's like white but there is like that half panel of, of wood on the bottom and I think it like keeps it all together really well and I think it looks more like a Japanese style school you know um, but I don't know let me know how you like it I really do like it um, I think everything turned out really really nice I think the only classroom that I had some sort of like oh, with was the science room <laughs> if you can even tell that it's a science room uh, you will see that I'm gonna be making it in a couple minutes and honestly I can tell you right now it was not my favorite <laughs> But that's okay because that's what happens when we do builds. We, 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 we make things and we either love or hate it. And I guess I wouldn't say hate. I guess it's like a strong word, but like, I dislike it. I didn't, I, it wasn't my cup of tea. It wasn't my creme brulee. <laughs> Speaking of which, I love creme brulee. I don't, fun fact. I, I think creme brulee is really good. And speaking of creme brulee too, another food that I have tried recently that I actually really like is deep fried milk. Now hear me out, hear me out. Deep fried milk, like what? I went to a place, right? <laughs> I went to eat and I went with this place with my boyfriend and we just went there for dinner, uh, like for Valentine's Day, it was just really nice. And he was like, we're gonna go to this like restaurant and you're gonna try deep fried milk. And I, <laughs> if you can picture the, the facial expression of just like a, a huh? like what? <laughs> and then picture that with having someone say that to you it's like what what is deep fried milk and g g girl girl it is probably one of my new favorite things i love it is so good and then once i left because he lives like an hour and ish away from me he I, I went back, right, and I was on the call with him, and he says, oh, guess where I'm going tonight with my family, and I was like, where are you going, and he told me the restaurant that we were, that they were going to, which was the one that he took me to when I had the deep fried milk, and I was like, oh, how dare you say that, <laughs> I'm so jealous, 
Um, but yeah, I've gone into a lot of like different foods and drinks too. I've had an unhealthy obsession with Cha Time. I, I honestly, Cha Time sponsor me one day, please. <laughs> but I am like, I'm such a fan, girl. I can't, I could told you how much money I've spent on bubble tea. <sighs> My wallet is crying. <laughs> But it is so good. So let me know. Do you have any like favorite drinks or food? Let me know in the comments down below because I could talk all day about like food and drinks. <laughs> it's just a wonderful thing in life, especially nowadays with everything coming on. It's food is like it brings you like a nice, warm, happy feeling. Unless you're having ice cream, then it's not warm. It's happy, but it's but it's not warm, you know. <laughs> so here I'll talk about the actual bill because I am rambling on. Here I actually wanted to make a like stand roller thingy like of the of the TV that you saw me just do that briefly. And I don't know about you, but every time that I was in elementary school and even some like rooms in high school, we had the the rolly thingy <laughs> that had the TV like the box TV on it. Ah, oh, so nostalgic. It's so great. I <laughs> so when I saw it, I was like, you know what? And it, it is just it just dawned on me that I was like, well, why don't I do this for here? So I tried to find like a, a little little like table, and it worked. I I can't tell you what pack it was from, and I can't tell you how many packs I used. I guarantee, I have used almost every single pack. This build is half of a million dollars, and like real life, this would be like millions, but like. In The Sims, we're, we're like half a million. I have never made a home that's one million dollars. I have tried. I have a, actually, I have a build on my gallery that has a box. It's called a box of just a mansion. It's called a box of a mansion. And when I was originally trying to build it, I wanted, like, I had the mindset of, oh, this is going to be my million dollar mansion. And I, you know what? If you want to see it, I still, I just have the box. I got rid of the actual tape of me building it. But if you want to see like me do the inside of it, uh, let me know if you guys are kind of like interested in that because, and, and you don't mind not seeing me build everything. To be fair, it's, it's literally just like a box. And I have uh, like the pillars done. I have the outside, like the windows, everything. Just nothing is done on the inside. So if you kind of want to see that and and you're the tad a bit curious let me know and maybe I'll try and do that as well because it's kind of just sitting <laughs> it's kind of just sitting there in my gallery and like a lot of people are downloading it so I guess it's okay so if you want to see me build that I guess like the interior and try and make it a million dollar mansion uh, let me know yeah I definitely I would definitely be down for that um, but enough talking the floor plan for this build I did change a couple of things in this part it was mostly between like part one and part two uh, like in particular but I wanted to have like three box openings on on the second or third floor because I saw a picture of like this anime school slash like academy and it looked like so nice. It was so like open. I'm assuming it was probably like a university of some sort, but it looked really nice and I wanted to incorporate that in The Sims at some point in this build. So we have the music room that you saw and you can see it on the top right there. And I wanted to have three openings to kind of give it that like that open feel so like the bottom floor is more like a traditional type of school and then you got like the t uh the second and third floor which is a little bit like more open and i really really like that about this school in in particular and i had these tiny little rooms that i had to work with that you can see right here so i decided to make the third floor like a counselor room and i made this like a really 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 tiny art room <laughs> Trust me, I wanted to make like a lot of the other rooms a lot bigger, but I wanted to make like the the ones by the hallway like an actual like actual classroom. I know that art would be an actual class it would be classified as an actual classroom, but I didn't for some reason I just didn't want to give it its full glory. 
here this gym gave me some I want to say headaches because I wasn't sure how I felt about the actual like I don't know like the actual wallpaper of the first floor I should have changed it to like a paneling um, I don't know why I didn't change it but if you want to it's up on the gallery if you are actually interested in downloading this it is just my name my gallery name will be at the end of the video or it will still be in the description down below but if you you want it you can definitely change it because I don't know how I feel about it. I, I saw a picture. I don't know what it was from. I don't know if it was from that, again, in my butcher, right? That Haikyuu, that Haikyuu, like, <laughs> anime. Um, and the top part was, like, blue. So I wasn't sure, you know? Um, I also got this idea from, I think... Freezer Bunny, uh, who is a YouTuber. He's a YouTuber here on YouTube, and he did this with the um, barrel and a lot of the uh, basketballs, and I thought it was such a great idea. I idea. I Ikea? <laughs> I thought it was such a great idea, so I wanted to incorporate that as well. So all full out shout out to him. He did that for his uh, Japanese building uh, for like his school. If you want to go check that out too, his is really good as well. Um, so yeah, he does that in his gym. Uh, I think that's the only thing that like inspired me to do so because... When I, I was looking through a bunch of things and I was like, I don't know what to do for this like gym or what it would look like. And I saw that he put those like in the basket. So I was like, oh, I want to do that too. But I want to give credit where credit is due. So shout out to him. It, it, it looked really cool. <laughs> but yeah, we are starting to get to the very end of this video. So if you liked it, please maybe consider subscribing, liking, commenting. And if you just saw this video and you're at the very end of this video, girl, what are you doing? <laughs> Go look at the part one and two. It, would, it just wouldn't make any sense. So I will have it all at the very end of the video for you guys and all the screenshots and everything that you want to see. So um, yeah. <laughs> I guess I'll see you all later. Bye, guys.